What up, what up? How's it going, guys? West Coast Cannabis here with Optic LED Grow Lights. Dot com. Man, I hope you guys have been having a good time in your gardens lately. So check this out, man. We have the Optic 8 Plus Next Generation 550 Watt Destroyer and the Slim 480. Oh, look, check that out, man. Slim 480. I still got to finish getting that bad boy set up. And the cool thing is I'm actually going to have the one touch screen running both lights independently. I'm going to show you guys once I get all that set up. Now, we have a new grow series coming up. It's uh, Learn How to Grow Like a Pro. So we're going to show you guys from the very beginning, from seed or clone, from the very beginning, we're going to show you guys exactly how to grow. So we have a grow series coming up where I'm going to share, we're going to do Growing 101. I'm going to share with you guys everything from the very beginning. You know, there's a lot of you who have already seen and heard, you know, a lot of the different techniques that I use and everything, but there's a lot of new growers out there and there's a lot of people who need to have really high quality medical cannabis to treat their medical ailments. So check this out, man. I absolutely, the Optic 8 is my favorite light of all time. I've had my hands on a lot of LED grow lights over the years, and I love the Optic 8 because it's one of the very few lights that truly does replace a 1,000 watt double-ended HPS. Now this new version is 550 watts. There's definitely some things that I love about it. Check the control panel. You can see here, let me put it into manual mode real quick here. Let me turn these down. Okay, we have it turned down. This is all the way down on power. So check this out. First thing I want to show you, look how huge these lenses are. Look at that. I'm going to actually, I'm going to turn the cobs off for just a second here. So we have lenses. These lenses are twice the size of the previous lenses. It's a bigger lens for a wider beam spread. If you take a look, look at that. Boom, solderless cob holders. Now these are stainless steel solderless cob holders. Now that would make it really easy is if, if you ever wanted to put a new cob in there, right? Look at that, you could just plug a new cob chip right into there. But these are those CXB 3590s. They're still, they're American made, still proven the highest gram per watt yielding chips around. Now, as you can see here, the bloom enhancer is all the way down. Let me see, so it's all the way down. And if we turn it up, boom, there we go. We have 100 watts pumping through the bloom enhancer. Take a look up here. With just the bloom enhancer on, it actually is a passively cooled system. It's only when we turn the cobs on that the fans are gonna kick on. But these bloom enhancers are a big part of the upgrade, so take a look at that. You have your deep reds. You have, see these white LEDs? Those are the Samsung horticulture specific LEDs. So we got the reds and blues in there. And we also have UV and IR. So take a look here. We have our IR and then we have our UV. That's what we have here, UV, UV. It's a purple, those purple LEDs. That's the ultraviolet. You know, if we take a, a look straight up here, this bloom enhancer is a huge upgrade. Instead of only the 32 LEDs, now we have over 170. And instead of it only having 50 watts max power, we're pumping 100 watts through it. Look at these absolutely beautiful guys. Beautiful. These bloom enhancers are incredible. So yeah, there's definitely some cool upgrades. Controller port. That's a really big upgrade. Dude, that's massive. So we put it back into controller port mode. Turn the cobs on. And this is, that's what we're going to be growing with next round. We're going to have the automated sunrise and sunset. We're going to have a slim 480 right here. Boom. The slim 480. And see these LEDs right here? Those are the same exact LEDs as what these are. That's our next gen bloom enhancer tech, basically. That's what you, you've got on the slim. Now let me show you this. Oh, what's that? Optic LED touchscreen controller? No way, dude, dude. See how we're in zone one? There's also zone two, that'll be the slim series light. Ooh, that was loud. Now let me show you this. It's worth it, okay? <laughs> 
Now we're in the controller mode. Let me show you here. So what I'm going to do, let me see here. Oh, those are those ones. I want to show you how we can turn just the corner cobs up. Look at this guys. You can see that those corner cobs are significantly brighter. These are only at 10% power. Those are at 82%. You can see those corner cobs super bright, right? Then we can beam up the other cobs. Let's turn those corner cobs down and beam up the center cobs. See that? You got those four. Let's go ahead and turn those down. And check out this. Bloom enhancers. What? We can turn, crank those bloom enhancers up. Look how bright those are. 100 watts pumping through those bloom enhancers. It's a 550 watt fixture. So now we're going to go back to those corner cobs. In bloom, those corner cobs are going to blast those corners. So you have high par corner to corner. And then, of course, we can turn up the very last little bit here. Those other cobs. Now let's go ahead and get this thing on full power. 100% power. Dang, and look how bright that is. Dude, it lights this space up major. It's crazy bright. Bigger light, more beautiful, more powerful, better tech, more refined, and the controller. So today I'm just showing you guys what we've got set up here, what we have set up for the next run. I love this light. Optic 8, favorite all-time light to grow with. The bud quality is absolutely amazing. And I also am falling in love with the Slim Series Tech. The Slim Series Tech is amazing. These huge fixtures spread the light out so evenly you get nice even growth but the cobs penetrate better and grow bigger plants deeper canopies with fatter buds so if you want bigger plants and to get more yield per plant the optic 8 is a par penetration machine think about all that intensity focused into that one cob chip and then having the the lens to focus the light even further so you have some major intensity there versus over here we have a fixture that you know is much bigger, but then it spreads the light out more evenly around the space versus this is gonna send par deeper into the canopy. So there's a little preview, guys. Like I said, we have the a grow series coming up where we're just gonna start from you know the very beginning and show you guys all the way through a learn how to grow series, grow like a pro. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I know you guys haven't seen me for a minute, but I will be keeping you posted with that new grow coming up here in the next uh, several weeks. And it'll just be starting off with some small little plants and veg, and then we'll be flowering the Optic 8 and the Slim 480 side by side. Make it a great day, guys. We will catch you later.